Hello, I'm Mark Elston, and you're about to watch the promo for my incredible new trick, which is called The Trick That Can Be Explained. You're going to love it. Boom, hello, hello, and hello. And welcome to the most natural setting for a car trick that's ever been conceived in the realms of entertainment. So, I've got two things here. This is... Envelope. A envelope, correct. I'm going to leave that there in front of you. And this is a deck of cards. Cool. I'd like to take them, pick them up, take them out of the box, and give them a quick shuffle. That's cool. And then to put them down on the table. Great. Oh, a little bit in so they don't fall off. Just moving a bit. I think the what a precipice here on this boat. It's a bit weird. So I just went to cut the deck and com uh, cut it in half. Great. Complete the cut. So we've got a completely random place in the deck. And the card you've cut to is the Ten of Clubs. Now, in a minute, several things are going to occur to you. Several questions where you'll, you'll think, oh, wait a minute, what about this? What about that? What about the other? So I'm going to tell you what the questions you'll think of are, and we'll get rid of them now. So the first thing you'll think is, maybe there is another Ten of Clubs in the deck. So let's have a look. Is there another Ten of Clubs in the deck? No, no. no there is not. The second thing you might think is, hmm, maybe there's something hidden in the box. Anything else in the box? Yes. The third thing you might think is that this is some kind of tricky magician's envelope, because they do have those, you know, and uh, that there's more than one way into it. So pick it up, don't open it, but kind of examine it. Is there only one way in, one way out? Yep. Can you feel what's inside? Feels like a card. Just don't take the card out, but open the envelope. Just feel the edge of the card. Single card. One card. Yep. So, the next thing you might have thought was somehow there's a second card or a third card. There's not, there's just a one card. The final thing you might think is that in a moment when he places that card on my hand, I somehow switch it for one that will match the ten of clubs. So, in that, for that reason, I'm not going to get him to put it on my hand. I just want you to take it out, turn it over and place it on the table. Out. Ten of clubs, ten of clubs, one from you, one from you. Brilliant. Great, thank you, thank you, thank you. Fantastic. Cheers.